This was the first time in Minnesota history that a trial was live streamed and televised and we saw it in its entirety. So here's some of what was happening behind the scenes. Was on the back and neck. Special prosecutors Jerry Blackwell and Steve Slisher say Minnesota Attorney Wayne, General Keith Ellison formulated their overall strategy. Blackwell Please. focusing on medical aspects of the case, Slisher on Derek Chauvin's use of force. Strategy also included choosing not to use evidence from two prior incidents involving Chauvin, even though they had permission to do so. Instead, they honed in on a theme. You can believe your eyes. Telling the jury to believe their own eyes. Because what this case was about was about nine minutes and 29 seconds. Just like Jerry said in the opening, and just like we said in the closing. And Jerry Blackwell big. believes testimony from Dr. Martin Tobin and eyewitness Charles McMillan won over the jury. You couldn't listen to Charles McMillan and not resonate to the genuine pain, the expressions of caring and anguish that he expressed from the stand. 38 witnesses called to the stand, 12 jurors, finding the ex-officer guilty of all three charges in the death of George Floyd. It's a step forward in terms of our idea of equal justice. Nobody's beneath the law. People like George Floyd are not beneath the law. And nobody's above the law. Reporter Lou Goose sat down with the prosecution, and you can see the full interview with them on our YouTube page. Just go to YouTube and look for Kara Levin's account. Yeah, pretty interesting. So many different nuggets in there. I definitely would recommend going to check it out too. Kaya, thanks. Yeah, great insights. Our investigative team.